Well, I've had the privilege of going to many food festivals. I honestly had in my heart. Maybe I'm being a bit biased. I think this is the best food festival now in the country. I think it's growing. It's a beautiful location. Great parking, which is very important. Something for the families. I keep going back to the families because when you bring kids, it's about educating them about food. But there's something for them. The play area, agri-wear with the live animals. It's wonderful. And every year we're trying to do something different. This year, you know, the Home Chef, uh, Home Cook competition, which is fantastic. And I'm privileged to be part of it. So the Taste of Calvin, what an event. Just look at what's happened here over the last couple of days. You know, thousands of people, the footfall's been brilliant. I don't know what it is with this event. I attend a lot of them nationally. This one has something special. Definitely the Taste of Calvin is up there as one of the best events in the country. It's fantastic to be part of Taste of Kevin. Um, I've been here before and it's always a really fun, buzzy day or weekend. But what's really good and what's really important about it is actually that it's very important for the producers, all the local producers, to actually get to meet the community. It's a fun day out for the community, so it's a win-win situation. But it's really good for the community and for people coming and visiting with their families or on their own or with their friends to actually see the produce that is from around here and then, you know, help to support it. Cooking brings everyone together, but cooking home grown, with homegrown ingredients, well, that's just amazing. Yeah. It's my second year here, and it's just so family orientated. Uh, amazing people, amazing produce. I mean, you just couldn't ask for any more. Lovely chefs, and great to be here. It's just great to be here.